The couple have long proved that Mike, 44, and Zara Tyndall, 42, make a strong team. The former rugby player and Queen Elizabeth II's favorite granddaughter, 96 years old, has been married since 2011 and now has three healthy children. But in 2016, they had to go through the worst thing as parents, they lost their unborn child. Princess Anne's, 72, son-in-law, Princess Anne, spoke publicly about it in early October. Mike Tyndall, wife Zara's miscarriage was horrific. In an interview with The Times, Mike Tyndall opened his heart and recalled the terrible stroke of fate in December 2016. At the time, the couple already had a daughter Mia, and the previous month they had announced Zara's new pregnancy. Then disaster struck in the fifth month, Zara suffered a miscarriage. The Queen's granddaughter had to deliver the stillborn unborn baby naturally because it was too late to remove or suction it. Husband Mike recalled the moment and explained it was horrific, we had to come out and tell everyone that we had lost the baby. The life we lead means we have to publicize it and we have to give it away. What bothered him most was that women and mothers look at themselves as if it's their fault. However, luck was then on Zara and Mike's side, God gave them two more healthy children. Baby Lucas was born in 2021. The birth happened so quickly that the couple didn't even make it to the hospital. Zara Tyndall's husband Mike, after the miscarriage, it was daughter Mia who gave them strength. Tyndall also emphasized in the interview that he was extremely grateful that he had a healthy daughter before Zara's miscarriage. When you come home from the hospital and Mia is standing there with a smile on her face, you put all your love into her. If we had come to an empty house, it would have been a very different scenario, says 44. Year old quoted. Fortunately, the terrible loss did not harm the Tyndall's marriage. On the contrary, it only strengthened Zara and Mike's love. Even after 12 years of marriage, the couple is still over the moon.